Hello, I'm Kyle Wolver, the Director of Logistics for Superior Ambulance Service. Today, we want to demonstrate our decontamination processes in both our ambulance operations and our wheelchair van paratransit operations in light of the recent COVID-19 situation. Let's go over our manual brew tab process. To begin, let's go over the PPE required. We're gonna need gloves, eye protection, and respiratory protection while spraying the vehicle. To start, you're going to be getting a pack. Inside that pack is going to be your bottle, 10 brew tab tablets, instructions, and your spray nozzle. You're going to take your bottle, fill it with water. You're going to take four of the small brew tab tablets and drop it in to the water and allow that to dissolve. And it's important to know that if you have one of the large tablets, and I'll do a comparison for you, the small to the large tablet, we want one large tablet in. But again, if it's the small tablets, we want four tablets in. Once that dissolves, you're going to put your spray bottle mister onto the top. They typically come in the locked position, so you're going to want to adjust it until you get a nice misting solution. On the bottle, we want to take a piece of tape and write the date of when we use this product as the product is good for five days. Once our spray bottle solution is dissolved, we want to take the spray and just put a fine mist over top of the vehicle. Making sure we hit all surfaces to properly decontaminate it. You don't need to go overboard on it, but just a fine mist on top of the surface will make sure that it kills. Contact time is one minute to kill this with this new process. It's important to note that for demonstration purposes, I did not spray the entire vehicle. Once we're done with the front of the vehicle, we want to move to the back of the vehicle. Same process, we're going to take our BrewTab manual sprayer, spray a fine mist over all surfaces, making sure that we get them wet. Contact time with the new solution is one minute to kill COVID-19 and any other decontaminants. We're going to move through the vehicle, making sure again that we just continue to spray making sure that we have our PPE on. Total time for the vehicle, for the air exchange process is 30 minutes. We can do this during that 30 minute period because we're wearing our PPE. Make sure we get the floors, make sure we get the ceilings, and we are decontaminated. Let's talk about the cot. There's two ways to disinfect. We can either use our brew tab, or we can use our striker wipes. If we're gonna use BrewTab, make sure no sheet is on. Take your BrewTab sprayer, spray down the entire cot. Allow that to air dry. If we're gonna use our striker wipes, we're gonna wipe down the cot, again, allowing that to air dry. Do not forget your buckles and your straps to wipe those down. When working with the Medicar, we can utilize our brew tab to disinfect the vehicle. We take that brew tab sprayer, spray the front of the cab thoroughly. You just need a fine mist on it. Nice coating. Allow that to dry, and your front of your vehicle is decontaminated. When moving to the back of the vehicle, we want to take our brew tab. Spray the entire back of the Medicar. For demonstration purposes, it's important to note I'm not getting every surface wet. But again, we don't need to go excessive, just a nice light coat on there. One minute to kill all contacts. You can spray down your wheelchair or you can wipe it down with your striker wipe. Allow this to dry. You can spray this because we're wearing the proper PPE while that air exchange is happening and your vehicle is decontaminated.